Alright guys, welcome back to a brand new video, and in today's video, I'm going to be explaining how to make a portfolio for Roblox jobs. Now, what does that mean exactly? Well, basically, this is going to be how to get jobs on Roblox, and basically how to make a portfolio so you can get more jobs. So, yeah, if you guys don't know what a portfolio, a portfolio is, basically, it's just like a place where people can look at your work and see what you've done, see if they like your style, and stuff like that. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so first things first, why should you make a portfolio, okay? So, great question. A portfolio is important because people can see what you can do right they can see exactly what you can do and they can see they like your style so if people are looking to hire you know scripters or builders whatever you specialize in then you can they can easily you know see what you're capable of and uh, it's your chance to sign and then impress them and then you can get hired and you know make some money um so yeah or robux but yeah um here's let me show you an example of a good portfolio I like this one a lot uh this guy's portfolio is um it's solid a little. All right, so yeah, basically it's a, it's a UI and programming portfolio, and he shows here it says about me, and he goes, hey there, I'm you know Kaimara, platform for nine years, uh, blah blah blah. He's studying, okay, and then uh, he has his released games linked right here, right? So he has a game right here, Prop Pursuit. 55 players, almost a million visits, kind of cool to look at. Uh, and then he has uh, programming examples, and then he has like a list of all his stuff right here. Um, and let me actually show you the. Let me show you the. Oh crap. All right, let me show you the the playlist of his work. Okay, so this is, as you can see here, look at this. All right, um, he has like this crystal thing, I guess crystal turret. He shows that he has like this hot potato round thing. Um, I don't know what this is. Uh, a cooking mechanic, like all this really cool stuff, right? And it, and maybe it's not used for specific, specific games, but as you can see here, he's showing that he can do this stuff. And you guys probably can't do it's honestly not that difficult to do some of the stuff he's doing. But anyways, um, as you can see here, he does have all his portfolio here and all like that, which is pretty cool. And then he has um, some of his like UI because he's a UI designer, which doesn't look that bad actually. I'm gonna hire this guy one day. Um, and then he has packages, which are coming soon, apparently. And then he said he says he's only accepting payment via PayPal or bank transfer. And then Discord, contact. And then he says, I'm just going to be able to fire. And then there's some proof to show he's Kaimara, I guess. Okay. Interesting. Pretty cool, though, right? Um, just pretty simple, pretty straightforward. But it does show that he is, um, you know, hardworking or whatever. And that he does have the credentials. And he can do what he says he does, right? So that's awesome. That's what you want. You want to make sure someone is credible and they can do what they, what they say they can do. So yeah, that's a good. That's a good example right there. Um, but yeah, all right. So now, um, how do you make gears like that? All right, how do you make a good portfolio? So basically, step one is you want to go ahead and find all of your work. Okay. So what I mean by that is go find everything that you've done. All right. Even if you think it's kind of bad, I would still just you know find it and you know figure out the file of it or wherever it's saved, and then you know go collect all that stuff of whatever you want or whatever you want to put on there, all your best stuff preferably, right? And take a short GIF or even a picture of each thing to show it off, right? So as you can see there, he actually made whole YouTube videos or little clips of YouTube videos just showing them off there and you link to that. But you could do, um, you know, just um, a GIF, right? Um, which can just show... You know, a GIF, right? Which is like just like a little like um, image that, that moves around. Which you can do that too. That works. And then, um, or you can make a video like that. That either way works. But you want to find all your best work you can show people. So also, a lot of people say, "Well, I don't have any work. I haven't done anything yet." Well, it's okay. All right, we were all beginners at some point. Now, listen, there was a point in time where I didn't do anything either. Okay. Um, so if you don't have anything that, that you're proud of, well, then just go make something. Okay. You got plenty of resources online. You can learn pretty much anything you want on Roblox, and you I I believe that you're capable to make anything you really want so just go make something that you're proud of go make something that people want to see you know think about it like hmm, what, what would what would this guy be looking for or what, what would you know people be looking for inside of um, you know a portfolio and just do it get inspiration from other developers go look at their portfolio see what they're doing and see if you can do it too right at least try to learn if you can't do that stuff um, so yeah so yeah just do that find your work and if you don't have any work make some okay all right step two is draft of the portfolio okay we're shipping right into it so basically um what we're gonna do right now actually is i'm going to write my own portfolio with you guys all right now i'm gonna be honest i don't have much work um that i i, ha I didn't pull it up i forgot to but it's fine all right so uh, i'm gonna show you guys how i make the portfolio or how you can make it and uh, i'm going to do it with you okay i'm gonna walk through step by step with you all right so what i'm gonna do is open up the dev forum right here okay this is uh dev and if this if you don't know what this is this is an official dev forum by roblox themselves and people um it's, it's like moderated and stuff and people um post on here the portfolios um what they need stuff like that um as you can see this guy right here is hiring a scripter 
Oh wow! I actually I know the person who um, was working on this game. I guess they got fired. That, that kind of stinks. <laughs> okay. Anyways, <laughs> um, all right. So, um, yeah. How do you make a portfolio? Okay. So as you can see here, you have this button up here. If if you're a member, I, I'm not sure if there's a certain rank. I'm pretty sure anyone can make a post right now. Unless because they keep changing it. But basically, you go ahead and hit up here, open draft. And as you can see right here, I already have something something ready. Okay. And this will literally make this. This this will this will make a template for you. You don't have to even do anything. All it all it does is um here I'll even like um cancel abandon hit new topic it'll draft it up for you. So you order your category. Okay, let's say I want um uh, portfolio. Make sure you put the right category too because you don't want to get the wrong category because people get kind of mad. <laughs> and then there you go. It already gives you this basic template of what you what you can do. Right. So that's pretty cool. Right, so um, as you can see here, right here about me, and obviously I would change it up a little bit. As you can see right here, this guy, um, he like he like he inserted his own little images, so that way he can like I guess show off a little bit better with that, which is kind of cool. But um, if you do want to make it simple, then you can just you know use just the basic thing right here. But as you can see here, it's going to show you actually what's going on right here, and it'll update right as you type. Right, so showcase. There you go, and it'll show you exactly what you're gonna gonna be getting. Uh, and what it'll look like when it's done. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, so uh, what I'm gonna do right here is make my own portfolio. All right, I'm gonna do it with you guys. All right, I really don't need to find work that bad to be honest with you, but I'll do it. All right. So hi there. I have an offering for service as a scripter, and and I am a very good scripter. Hire me or else. <laughs> okay. Um, this is gonna like be kind of like a like a bad a bad portfolio. Do not do exactly what I'm doing right here. Definitely like look into it. Like see what people are doing. Talk about yourself. Talk about how like um how long you've been scripting. Uh, I've been scripting uh for seven years, and I basically uh scripted. Arsenal. All right, there we go. And now everyone thinks you scripted Arsenal. Don't lie, obviously, but I'm, I'm making a little joke right here. But just put what you can do, and you know, talk about yourself a little bit. Say this is about me, right? Um, people wanted to get to know you a little bit. All right, talk, maybe talk about how old you are too. Like, um, you know, this age, I'm 35 years old. I'm, I'm not 35, but, <laughs> um, and there you go. Um, yeah. So, okay. All right, next is showcase. So you definitely want to show them what you're capable of. So you can actually see this person has a little, or this like the default thing, has like a game linked, where basically you can do that actually. If you want to, you can link a game, right? Um, with has that has all your entire portfolio in there. So you can make your own game actually with a portfolio and people can go in there and test it out. And that can be pretty cool actually. It's a good idea. I might I might actually that's a really good idea. I, don't, I just thought of that. But anyways, um yeah, just link your portfolio. Obviously it's, it's easier for building to do that, but like for you can do that for actually scripting too. So yeah. Alright anyways, so then as you can see here people post screenshots. If you want to post a screenshot all you have to do is just delete all that and then you can hit the upload button and then as you can see there you can hit browse. I'm not going to hit browse. I don't know what's going to pop up. So, yeah. Uh, also, there's a lot more things you can do here. You can also add bullet lists and stuff like that. Like um, um, this, this. You know, you get all this stuff, right? Um, so, yeah. Definitely should show that. So, put right here wherever you want to do. Link link your YouTube players or whatever it is. Put your, like, Gaiazo gifts or whatever you have, right? Just link whatever you need. Um, and there you go. And then, obviously, availability. As you can see here, I'm available to work for six to eight hours, okay? Um, I can work 24-7 because of quarantine. Hire me. Okay, there you go. <laughs> um, so yeah, you can do that too. All right, so then payment, obviously, if whatever you prefer. Personally, it, honestly, I would take Robux or um, or PayPal if I was scripting still, like commission based. But um, also, I I do want I would want percentage if I was scripting because that's like most important to me, and I want it to be paid off. I like to have like a you know piece of actual um a pie in the game. So um. You know, you could say that, or you could say that, you know, that your preferred payment method is just Robux. Maybe you just want a thousand Robux per script. I don't know what it is, but whatever you want, you can do, right? And like I said, guys, you can judge that by looking at other people's stuff, see what they're hiring, or see what they're charging, or whatever. And yeah. All right. Um, second or last, I guess, put your contact, put your, um, you could say it says here you can contact me on the dev forum or via Twitter. So you can plug your Twitter. Mine's real tap water. There you go. And, um, and there you go. That's pretty much it. Or you can put your Discord right here, like Discord um, Tapwater nine three five six. Right there you go. Um, and there you go. I don't think I don't 
Thanks for this corner. I don't, I don't know. Honestly, I forgot. But yeah, that's how you do that. So yeah, pretty simple, guys. That's how you make a portfolio. Um, just fill it out like that, and then hit create topic, and then it's gonna post it. And also, oh crap, um, type your type your title here. Um, just name it like whatever you like your username probably like use code underscore tap. Um, uh, programming programming portfolio. There you go. That's, that's pretty much that simple, right? Talk about your skills. Talk about what you want to do. And as you can see, actually, it'll pop up right here. Your topic is similar because what they're trying to do is give you like an answer because I think you're like trying to make a question. Um, but as you can see here, you can read this kind of stuff. This is what he has. Um, pretty kind of empty to be honest with you, but yeah. That's that. Pretty cool. All right, so yeah, um, that's how you do it. And yeah, all right, so actually we're going to finish off the slides. I think there's a few more slides. But yeah, uh, draft it up. Post it, see if you get any responses. All right, and also another thing you can do, it's kind of cheeky, like I said, but um, you can actually go to the comments of other people's portfolios. So basically, go to a um, a portfolio right here, okay? And you can uh, uh, comment, or actually, what you can do too, which is even more cheek here, um, go to the people who are hiring. You see this right here? Like, you see this guy that's hiring right here? Like, okay, look, let me, let me find an actual portfolio, okay? <laughs> um, like, portfolio... Basically, you go to the people that are hiring, and then you basically just say uh, under them, you, you just, like, basically this guy right here, he's like, um, uh, beautiful portfolio, I'm going to bookmark this, I'm going to scripter. And then you can reply to him and be like, hey, I'm a scripter, or something like that, or, okay? Or you can private message him, whatever you want to do. Like I said, kind of cheeky, but you can do it if you want to. Or you can just leave a reply and be like, wow, uh, great portfolio. Um, we can be scripter buddies, okay? And now that, I don't know what I wrote there, but you get what I'm saying, right? Um, that would let people know your scripter, and people actually go check out your portfolio too, and you might get work from that, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, all right, uh, yeah, and then pretty much that's it, guys. That's all you gotta do. That's how you make a portfolio. That's how you get more jobs. Um, I, if you are looking to make you know some money with game development or some Robux, then definitely do this. I recommend it. It's the easiest, simplest way. You can make your own games, but obviously there's a chance that it won't matter do well. But if you do want to make actually big money or whatever, and you're not don't want to just get paid flat uh, rates, um, then you know definitely make your own game. But do whatever you want. It's up to you guys. You do whatever you want to do. So yeah. Uh, pretty simple, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, guys. If you did, like always, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe with post notifications on so you get more videos just like this one. I upload Ro Roblox development related videos every other day. And also, guys, leave a comment if it's helped you out. I I'm actually kind of curious. Like, if any of you get a job from this, let me know because um, that'll be pretty cool, honestly, in my opinion. So, yeah. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.